I inherently believe that my number one job is to grow the next generation of leaders. I get to do that and I've been given that opportunity through this program. That truly at the end of the day when I go home, the pride that I feel when I see one of my young civilians or one of my contractors or one of the young captains or lieutenants that just showed up at the unit steps forward and makes a decision, makes a call, questions something. I really start to say I am growing that next generation of people that will not only be able to emulate what I learned and what I'm hoping to teach them, but that I hope they in turn will be able to turn around and when they have put you know, two or three decades worth of time into uh, the nation, that they're also teaching that next generation. Nowhere else, especially within the corporate world, are you ever going to be given this amount of responsibility to be leading a team, let alone an 18-member team of mission directors which are going to maintain satellite control authority of this vehicle through launch and early orbit. So nowhere else are you going to have that. Here I am, five years graduated from college, now leading an entire team that's going to be controlling this satellite out of Denver, Colorado. One of the big takeaways from this is this is the very first GPS-3 satellite. A whole lot of new capability is going to come with this new satellite that can be seen all the way across the world, integrated, better improvements in banking, improvements in agriculture, improvements in not only military but our allied partners with increased capabilities. At the end of the day, when you're watching the launch, you can really see the first steps of an entirely new generation of GPS capabilities that'll be available to over four billion people on the planet. The progress that we made over the last 25, 26 years that I've been serving has been eye-watering from a aviation perspective as well as a space perspective. The products that space gives us, both from, a, from an RF signal like GPS, but also from satellites that provide imagery and electronic uh, warfare information, has changed the way that we operate out in the field. Knowing that you know, when I come off the front of an aircraft carrier and I, can, uh, you know, I have recent photographs and images, greatly enhances my comfort level. Uh, when, I, when I cross that line and go into, uh, into a battle situation. The professionals here, both the military, the, the government civilians, as well as all the contractors that we work with, just have an immense depth of knowledge that I draw on, on a regular basis to you know, both enhance my technical ability, but also enhance the knowledge that, uh, that the Navy gets about all the systems that they're producing. I'm leading a team of people that is bringing new capability that originates in space to everybody on the planet. So when I look at it, I really look at this as just one avenue and one opportunity I have to truly start leaving a legacy and grow that next generation of, of leaders that are gonna propel us to where we have no idea where we're gonna go.